Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your speaking and welcome to play by email 6 turn 184 it's so cool to get notifications from enhanced UI when you don't have enhanced UI yourself <laughs> interesting huh? okay let's check out the comments real quickly mm. Where do I need to start? Here, from Ethiopia's capital is 27 versus 19 in Japan and Byzantine, that's a growth. Yeah, that's true, but overall population is not that good if I believe correctly. Nice gold though. So he's got 20, 40, 40, 53, 56, 76, 83. 83 overall population 83 and we roughly have 20 uh, 20 40 43 53 67 77 85 yeah 85 93 100, 106 at the moment, so I wouldn't be that much afraid. So, same goes for Byzantines. Byzantines are also crazy population. We're finally gaining them on food, though. So, yeah, Ethiopia is okay ish now, but overall, later in the game, he's gonna have problems, right? Uh, Matthew, why don't you post your other games to you, YouTube, Mr. Yorus? Well, the other play by emails are since the forum is still down, the other. Uh, Mm, the other play by emails are just not going all right I think they are trying to get the others rolling through the mail as well or try to use a different platform for the tracker but for now like the Polish forum is down and it's down for several months right now so this is the only one that like I guess people care the most this one play by email so it's up and running but the others one are not running yet so that's why oh and on YouTube it's just like oh, okay I uh, play by emails like overall YouTube since I'm trying to stream as much as I can like YouTube is sort of dead in the water at the moment so yeah yeah but this is standard speed speed rules so uh, okay Tunisia but do you have call on your territory yes I do have call on my territory uh, the call is here seven tile node and there is a three tile node here under this lumber mill so i've got overall 10 coal and i have 10 cities so the number is perfect for 10 factories so that's good <laughs> yeah throw this huh good shout they call me Bob. Hi, yours. You have already delayed your NC universities, your first scientist and rationalists. At this point, I doubt that you can afford to delay public schools, as it appears that Byzantium is getting away in science. Frigus would, of course, be cool, but at this point, you have no other choice than to risk it. Uh, well, I don't necessarily agree. I think we still have time to run around the parts. I know he's first at industrialization, but there's still other people in the game. There's still diplomacy going. So there's still options to... We don't need to physically war him. Or we don't need to war anybody else. At some point, somebody has to attack him. This is only domination, right? So even if like in super late game they're going to focus on him, it's still fine. Like, this is only domination victory. And we have an agreement with Byzantines that we're not going to attack each other before every other player on the map is going to be dead. Right? So, we're going to be the last two to fight. This is the agreement between us. So, somehow the other players will have to deal either with me first or with Byzantines. So, if Byzantines is the clear leader, he seems like a natural target. So, it shouldn't be that big of an issue, I hope. That we're delaying all the other stuff for so long. Hey yours, glad you've managed with Persia. Here's some points I would like to pay your attention to. You should rush to ideology ASAP. I don't think so. You should take time and carefully study what you're up to globally and in each city particularly. Grow, 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 and one more time grow. That's why I'm not working specialist slots in most of my cities because I want to grow. 
we're gonna stay on those 10 cities like forever and most probably we're not going to go into war with anybody else until probably modern era so that's the plan right now for now we're just sim sitting like sim city like crazy is this epic speed no this is standard speed hey Oslo FX yeah it's pretty old <laughs> I'm sorry uh, you should make a Galias and explore coastline in both directions ASAP that's a good point you should make peace with the religious city on the left you still are at war aren't you no oh he's just angry but I'm not at war with any city-states anymore they're just angry at me you should make uh, you should have taken Renaissance the previous turn you would have a chance to start Russian as next turn you won't need honor 5 in the nearest future I assume all this is emo you're far more experienced a player than me I have written all just in case good luck and have fun thank you and Aqueducts finally now well I want to finish honor and I want to finish honor for a very very simple reason if I'm not gonna finish honor right now if I'm not gonna finish honor right now when Russian is gonna start rolling and when ideology is gonna start rolling we're never gonna finish honor this is how it's gonna look like there's always gonna be something more important that we're gonna need to pick so if we're gonna finish honor right now we're like done tradition honor we're done we're gonna go into rationals and ideology and that's it all right so I want to have this done and I'm clicking it right now boom and it's done right so we've got tradition and we've got full honor and we're super happy about that so that's why I want to have it right now there we go perfect uh, same question where is your other games we would glad to see them I already answered that and Bogdan University Specialist why you don't use them well I don't use them let's take a look at micromanaging the cities I don't use them because I want to grow the cities right so I don't want to take away production from my cities and I don't want to take away food so I could take away let's assume I could take away production instead of food so I could take away this this shaves off three turns out of growth right three turns out of growth for roughly 10 science right I don't think I want to do that yet I'm where are you going to kill Byzantium at the very 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 super crazy late game that's when so we still need a lot of infrastructure to be built like a lot of stuff to be built and I still want to grow those cities I think I prefer to grow like I could work the specialist slots in some cities like for example this but the cities that have problems growing I want them to grow before they're gonna work on specialist slots yeah all the wonders are banned in this game there's only domination only national wonders are allowed in this game everything else is banned that's why there's so many wonders on this list <laughs> it's crazy okay I think we're gonna grab an armory here we're gonna grab an armory here and we're gonna crank out a couple of galliasses here that seems like a good idea uh, barb camp is still there this city is okay is this city okay this city is okay by the looks of it this city is okay though can we micromanage something not really not really but we can definitely produce something so do I need more crossbows or summarize I could use some military oh I could use some workers too we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one additional worker would inherit that's for sure so let's grab one more worker here scout scouting yeah would be very hard to get into those wonders okay remove roads we don't need those more farms 
uh, even more farms so wait a second I was supposed to next turn annex some cities and buy mosques one more religion to be founded this is my religion this is my religion and this we need a missionary by the looks of it uh, do I really want missionary here uh, no I don't think so there's no pressure from Catholicism anymore so it should flip very very soon and do we have a garrison in every single city yes we do that's great we need more good stuff around the place and let's take a look at the cities one more time looking good looking good looking good looking very good and capital is looking glorious unless we can micromanage it something so it can grow in one turn no okay yeah I need a worker in the capital too okay any quests for the city states merchant scientist merchant writer scientist and prophet this we can do as well all right so that's it for this turn then as i said like long-term plans i think we're done with the war right now i want to scout this side a little bit more and depending what we're going to find out from the scouting i think we're overall done I think like Byzantines are in such a good shape that nobody really wants to go to war yet. And there's probably going to be some some allying going. A lot of players like Songhai and Rome definitely wants to SimCity a little bit. Ethiopia is still SimCity leading the science. Aztecs want to recuperate from the war too. And Portugal seems to be not doing that great at all. So if they want to somehow win this they will need to do they will need to, to do a lot of diplomacy all around the place and we have a diplomacy agreement with byzantines that we're not going to fight until very very late game so the question is can we out sim city him later in the game that's the question he's also full tradition right tradition five liberty two russian is one so the question is can we maybe not out sim city him but can we be in a shape that our full honor will make it work for us in a modern era or information era warfare that's the question i think it should there's no rush for us we're in a spot that we only need to worry about the coast right now so the question is do anybody wants to attack us on the coast and make business even stronger that's the question that we need to answer all right, so that's it for this turn. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time. Best wishes, yours out.